In the last one decade, um, ICTs have emerged as a frontline uh, technologies for agriculture transformation in uh, sub-Saharan Africa. Uh, governments, uh, developmental agencies, donor communities, they are all increasingly relying on uh, use of ICTs to unleash the potential of uh, smallholder agriculture, as well as integrating the value chains to connect various actors from production to the market to the end users. IATA has been using ICTs in its research for a very long time. Now IATA is bringing in um, innovation in use of ICTs, not only for research management, but also for uh, giving uh, tools that are relevant for our stakeholders, particularly smallholder farmers who can benefit from the research as well as the, the data that is being generated for the decision making. At IATA, we make use of big data on a lot of grants. It includes use of data science, machine learning, artificial intelligence through the wrangling of data and data engineering. The platform that we started with is the Institutional Data Repository second. What we are doing at IITA is that we ensure that data that are captured conforms with CGIAR ontology standard. We also combine ICTs with mass media or traditional media such as the internet or terrestrial radio videos, mobile projectors to further expand the reach of these ICTs. IAT uses digital tools and uh, platforms for precision agriculture, data management, analytics, trend analysis, and forecasts. We have a range of tools that are utilized for multiple applications. IAT has established over 50 different types of uh, ICT products. Uh, in-house in collaboration with partners within Africa as well as in other countries and these tools are used both for research as well as for uh, development and delivery of our uh, products under knowledge. The IATA digital delivery strategy outlays several objectives to use and position ICTs for delivery of our products and knowledge. First a framework is being created for uh, delivering research knowledge using digital tools and platforms to ensure wide-scale adoption and impact. The platform is called as IITA Digital Agriculture Service or IDAS. Uh, a suite of ICT packages will be developed to promote and um, modernize service delivery and extension. For example, IITA developed Seed Tracker to improve the quality and efficiency of cassava seed production and the seed sector in Nigeria. The seed tracker was piloted in 2018 for cassava in the southwest region of Nigeria. In 2019, the National Agriculture Seed Council adopted it as an e-certification platform for Nigeria, extending its applications beyond cassava. Now it is being used for e-seed certification for all crops. An IIT supported an innovative platform, Seed Tracker, has been facilitating our electronic uh, seed certification in ensuring that we have a well-coordinated production of seed that is high in quality. The seed tracker tool has been very effective because we also use it for marketing. So we use it to get in our customers and make life even easier for our customers. IT's strength lies in its unique ICT experience and understanding of the need of farmers and end users to design and develop user-centric digital services. The IAT has tailored ICTs for crop management advisory service delivery to farmers and farmer organizations and extension agents in government and NGOs through smartphones. Some very good examples include the development of a package of best economic practices for dissemination to end users using ICT app called Akelemo. The fourth objective is to develop e-learning platform to promote remote learning and skill building. This platform will offer a new way to enhance education and facilitate capacity building among players in agriculture space. This involves working with the formal school system to introduce agriculture subjects and provide opportunities for exposure and experimental learning. It also provides mechanisms for bringing youth or women entrepreneurs together to learn about agribusiness using an online education platform. And it brings training course on agriculture to users via digital learning portal. We develop and promote the use of digital tools for specific applications to enhance the digital footprint and outreach of IITA applications. This involves collaboration across teams in IITA 
and its partners. The framework provides a central platform for enhancing and developing new ICTs and offers strategic advice to users aiming to develop new applications. In the longer term, ITA aims to use ICTs for fast-tracking agriculture transformation in sub-Saharan Africa.